steel guitar. It doesn't much matter anymore, does it? The slow wandering, the songs I sang to myself, the rooms I rented for a few months at most, and working odd jobs. And a few years back, I left my steel guitar in one of the rooms, but I never went back to get it, and I miss it, though I could never get myself to play in front of anyone just nights after work, especially when some of the jobs tired me out, mostly restaurants, since I'd do anything from washing dishes, mop the floor, and even helping out in the kitchen, though I didn't like waiting. The people giving you orders, treating you like some servant what owes them service, listening to them like their soup was the most important thing in the world, then turning to each other, sometimes even talking um, their secrets to each other, like he wasn't listening, because you don't count, then back to my room smelling like fried smoke, bean, eggs, I asked Gail's husband, I even forget his name, for 20 bucks because I left my wallet back in the room and he lends it to me and then I went to his house to pay it back in the morning. I was off from work and Gail was there and she asked me in and gave me coffee and we talked, though I mostly listened about how he always left her alone and was tired. So we kissed and she said she didn't want to do it there in her own room, in her own bed. So we went to my place and were in the bedroom before we even got into the door and she was so warm and held me so tight. We just didn't want to leave. But we had to, and we met a few more times when I, I knew he wasn't there. Uh, but someone must have seen us, and he found out, and he waited for me one day, and I got a black eye. But I didn't defend myself, because I knew he was right, so I left town. I miss my steel guitar. It kept me company, and I sometimes try to make up a song about Gail, and it never comes out quite right, sometimes too romantic. And I don't like romantic songs, because they are for women and gays, and it's fine for them, since that's the way they are. But I was raised to be a man, so I try not to cry when something really hurts, and that's when I would take out my guitar and just play, since I'm not one of those romantic types. As soon as I can afford it, I'm going to buy me another guitar.